Welcome to TextBlaze. Today we will learn how to use the drop down menu. And if you're new here, TextBlaze is the fastest way to automize your snippets on the web. Let's get started. So here we are on the TextBlaze dashboard, and we're going to go ahead and create a new folder by creating a new snippet. Let's go ahead and title this DD for drop down. Shortcut will be lowercase d, lowercase d. And we're going to go ahead and insert a text. Let's pretend that we are a customer service rep. And depending on the issue, we're able to give a discount to the clients. Let's go ahead and go to the forms and dynamic content and click drop down field. As you can see, you have three choices. You can add more or take them out if you'd like. And let's just go ahead and put 10% for the first one. We can go ahead as well and choose 15% for the second one. And lastly, we could do 20% because the person had a really terrible time. We insert that and we can go to preview and see what that would look like. Notice that it says 15%, but we can go ahead and change it to 20%. Now we can go ahead and try this out. Just type in the shortcut DD. And as you can see right there, 15%, let's go ahead and change it to 10. And voila, that's it. On a side note, just remember you yourself created the shortcut. That's what's going to insert the snippet. We can go ahead and try this out on Gmail if we'd like. Go ahead, create uh, an email. We're going to go ahead and type in the shortcut ED. And once more, we get the pop up, click whatever discount we want, and that's it. And that's how you create a drop down menu with TextLates. Remember, you can use this all over the web. Thank you, and until next time.